Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to add WhatsApp chat to Wix website. But before we start, hurry up and check out our digital software just under this video. So let's get started. So how do we add a WhatsApp chat to our Wix website? Well, what we need to do is we need to actually first access our Wix website and we want to go ahead and go to home or other, either in the setup page here and click on the edit site option. Now, in this case, for us to add a uh, WhatsApp bubble here, what we need to do is we need to actually use a different platform. But the great thing here, this platform is actually for free. So in this case, we'll be using elfsite.com. Now, creating your account here is pretty easy. You just need to click on the sign up or log in at the top right. And you could even use your Google account to sign up or even log in. Now, in this case, we need to search for a widget here. So let's go ahead and click on widgets here. And from here, let's go ahead and just type in WhatsApp press on enter and you should be able to see the whatsapp chat option here let's go ahead and click on it now what we need to do is we now need to actually um uh, start editing our uh, widget here so in this case you could go ahead and choose the type of template that you want to use so we have the general the message field here uh what oi team so in this case you can go and choose whatever team you want to use for example i'm going to use the default one here click and continue with this one now from here, we want to start connecting our WhatsApp account. So in this case, you just need to add your WhatsApp number or link. You also need to edit your content. So in this case, the bubble icon, you can change this if you want to. If you want to choose from a library or upload your own if you want to. You can even change the bubble text if you want to. I can also change the picture if you want to. So for example, I want to upload a different one. Let's go and click on upload. I want to use this one. Click on open. And that should replace the image that will be shown on your WhatsApp as you can see right now. Now you have the option to either change the welcome message as well, uh, start the uh, chat method, so start button or send message, have the button text here, like chat on what's, uh, WhatsApp, and you have the show icon in button if you want to. As you can see, the options here actually changes real time whenever you're editing something here. You can, you can even go to settings here, like changing the positions if you want to. Uh, you can even change the open uh, or even update the chat triggers here and the notifications if you want to. You can even change the colors here for the appearance, like the bubble background color, bubble icon color, and a lot more. Now, if you want to disable animations, you can go ahead and disable this one and the animation intervals here. But for now, we are good with what we added here. So in this case, you can go and click on add to website for free. And it should start generating our code here. But in this case, it would first redirect you in this section here. So just confirm things here. Um, go ahead and add them. But once you've added them, you could go ahead and start closing them. Let's go ahead and click on close here. And from here, as you can see, we now have our WhatsApp chat widget. So in this case, all we need to do is we need to click on the install button. And you could go and click on copy code here. From here, go back into your editor here. Click on the plus button or add element option. In this case, what we need to do is we need to choose the embed code option here. And from here, you want to choose the embed HTML option. Now, this should add a section for your uh, HTML. So in this case, uh, I would recommend you to first add them or basically uh, add a section here dedicated for that. So for example, I want to add a new section under this one. So I want to use the blank section option here and we want to actually position it. So let's just drag it. Let's go and click on our HTML here. Just scroll down, add this one. In this case, let's go and click on enter code, paste our code that we just copied, click on update. And that should actually start updating our code. So in this case, you could go ahead and put, start repositioning your bubble here. So in this case, if you want to put it in here or why not, so you could go ahead and do that. But for now, once you've done that, go ahead and click on publish at the top right. And that should actually publish your widget or your uh, WhatsApp chat here. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.